Welcome back to Josiah Plays Deus Ex Human Revolution. One crazy guy left here up in the Panchea project. I am going to sneak up on him and get him with the stun gun, I think. See what he does. He's going over there. Wait, what? What's he gonna do? Oh, I don't care what he's gonna do. Really? Come on. He went hostile from that? I was cloaked. I was literally cloaked. I guess he was looking right at where the stun gun went off, so he saw that in the brief second before he was, and that allowed him to hostile, hostilize. Totally a word. Ah, shit. Looks like I need to... Oh, yeah, he's... No, he's the last one. So these guys that are unconscious, I thought they would maybe unmark themselves when they got knocked out, but they don't. All right, we're going to wait a second. Let him uh, calm down. Let him go over there. There we go. And we will unmark him. Uh, unmark him. Why won't it unmark? Unmark that man. There we go. Oh, I have to aim the reticle at the mark, not at the guy. Got it. Oh, and I have to hit the correct key. I'm sitting there hitting R over and over <laughs> instead of T. And I'm like, why isn't it unmarking him? What the hell? And then I realized, yeah. So, okay. All the guys that are out here, all those crazies, knocked out. So I can get back to just kind of searching the area here. Um, you know, to see, see what's around. Because I do like seeing what's around. Hmm, this might have been a nice vantage point to snipe some guys, but of course... I didn't actually think of that. <laughs> Look how many I knocked out. That's crazy. All right. So, am I up at the top floor here of this of this little area? I think I am. Let's look at the map real quick. Yeah, I'm at the top top floor. So, let's look around the top. We've looked over there already. Here's a, um, a little storage unit, it looks like, that I can hack into, so let's do that. 95 stop worms. Okay. I don't even care, then. Don't even need a stop worm here, though. Access granted. Oh, good. Another stop worm. <laughs> Okay, uh, storage unit. What's in here? A little heavy rifle ammo, a little shotgun, a little gas grenade. And that seems to be it. Here's a lot of these guys. So here's one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, can't get in there, eight, nine, ten, what, uh, what else is around here, nothing, there's the ocean, there's the sun getting ready to set. A uh, hard hat, safety first. It's good. And Shea. Uh... 
Okay, what do we have going on over here? Looks like I can probably get in this way if I choose to. But I don't actually want to go in there just yet. Alright, so I think I've looked around everything up on the top level on the outside so far. What else is going on on this level? So on this level, we have... Well, hold on. Okay, so that isn't the... Uh, there were two staircases. All right, not just one. All right, well, we'll come back down to this level then and look around. Here's another another little um, looks like a little unit I can hack into here. So here we go. Oh, I think I accidentally hit a stop, but certainly didn't need to. Access granted. And in here we have a plasma rifle, a heavy rifle, lots of plasma ammo. Okay. What else is down here? It's a dead person. Security robot behind there, but nothing seems to have set him off, surprisingly. Oh, maybe I turned off the robot somewhere with a computer. Well, no, because if he was off, would it still be showing him on my radar like that? I don't think so. I don't remember now how that actually works. Here's a little storage unit with a shotgun, shotgun cartridges, combat rifle ammo, and that's about all that's in here, I think. Here's some more guys, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, huh, 16. 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, so 22 so far that I've counted that we actually took out here. What's over here? There? Oh. Can you hear me? I've got survivors here. We've locked ourselves in a machine room. Please! Help us! Okay, so Seraph's here, as well as Taggart. Those are both optional objectives that picked up of people we can go find. Find and speak with Seraph. Sounds like a group of survivors have locked themselves in a machine room. David Seraph is one of them. Maybe I should find him and ask him a few questions. Of course I'm going to find Seraph and Taggart. But uh, I'm not actually going to... Come in, back, come in here right now. What's this? What's this? Oh, that doesn't. Uh... Oh, it'll just let me open this, huh? Hey, wait a minute. What about? Wasn't there another one that I was like, can't get in there because the door wasn't. Mm, now I'm confusing myself. All right, forget it. Let's come back over here. That maybe that is. No, I don't know. I went in here, right? This is. Where the yeah. Hey, what's that? Oh, heavy rifle ammo. Alright. And then there's this one. Anything interesting in here? What's that? Credit ship. Okay. <laughs> Making money is what I what's on my mind right now. <laughs> so that's where my priorities are. Getting some money, you know. At a time like this, you never have too much. 
All right, I think that's it for this level. Now I'm curious though about curious about something. I know I'm being kind of ridiculous right now, but all right, I can get in there. So that's at least a couple ways in that I've found so far. Oh yeah, this door is this. No, no, no good. Okay, let's go back down. Um, to just the level I was just on. It must be. It must be. Yeah, it is. Okay. So then we'll go down one more level, which I think will be the bottom floor of this thing. Well, I mean, maybe not the bottom floor of the whole place, but the bottom floor of this outside area, I think. I mean, this is where the base of these huge uh, slanted... Oh, it isn't the lowest floor of this thing. That's right. There's a, technically a lower area right over there. Well, hold on. Let's just look around down here a little bit. Let's make sure I'm not missing any last minute um, interesting things to pick up. Any little pocket secretaries, ebooks, stuff like that that's just kind of stashed around here. Now, what's up with this shaft? I could jump down there, I suppose, if I w wanted to go nuts. That probably leads one down to, like, the very bottom. Um, but... And look, there's even... There's even some guys down there. Like, I could jump down an Icarus on those guys, and it would be really entertaining, probably. Um... But I don't know that I will do that, realistically. Maybe I will and then reload. I don't know. Let's just look around here first. Because I like looking around, as I'm sure you've now learned. Doesn't look like there's anything else around here, though. So then jump down to this. It's like some sort of tracks for, like... I don't know, some sort of train sort of, you know, cargo cars moving on tracks or something interesting like that going on here. Here we have said cargo car. Obviously probably all automated. Oh, and there's nothing. Nothing down here, not even any entrances, hidden vents, or uh, ways in, or anything down there. That's just a pure kind of dead end over there. So, at this point, I can go inside by a couple of different ways, uh, or I can jump down the shaft. <laughs> so, let's just, let's just quick save. Hop down there and be like, what's up, gentlemen? <laughs> I mean, of course, you know, it's not a good idea. I get down here, they've gone hostile. It, it's very rude. But it was pretty cool. <laughs> and then where does that put me? Yeah, it puts me down here. Oh, at the bottom of this thing, huh? Interesting. Yeah, I wonder about something. Do a couple reloads here real quick, because I want to I wanna see what happens if I do that. Well, no, I, I know what would happen. If I jumped down there while cloaked and did that thing with the Icarus landing, it would still make them hostile, because they all just got knocked on their ass. Of course, they're going to turn hostile. So, pretty cool, though. Pretty amusing thing to do, really. <laughs> I mean, I could even jump down there and just, like, do that and then use the, um... If I didn't care about being sneaky and or not killing people, I could jump down there, do that, and then use the, uh, Typhoon and just kill those three guys. But that's not actually what I'm going to do. So, what I'm going to do instead is come over here and figure out how to 
get inside here. And that's all the time I have. So thanks for watching. Josiah Plays, Deus Ex Human Revolution. I'll see you next time.